ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದು ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೇ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದನಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶ ಕಿ ಪಾಸಿಂದುಭವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರು ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗ ಪಂಗುಂಗ್ ಲಂಘೈತಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದೇ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಮಾಧವ ಬಿಂದಾವೈ ತುಸಿ ದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸಚ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೇ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಚೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿಂಗ್ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರು ಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ಬರೋನ್ನು ಧ್ಯೇಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟದೋಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವ ವಿರಿಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ವೇತ್ತಿಹಂ ಪನುತಪಾಲ್ಲಭವಾಧಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರುಣಾರಭಿಂದ ಯತ್ ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವಲಕಚಂದಮನಿಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತಕಮಿ ಗೋಪವಧೂಷ್ವಾದರ್ಶ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರಸಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿಂ ಕರುಷ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೈತಗಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೈತಗಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾಬುದಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಯುತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೋ ದ್ವಿಜರೋ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೋ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋ ದಿಬ್ಬರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಚ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ಚದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟ ಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭೂಷಿತ ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗ ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ಬರಾನುಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ಭಾಗೀಶಜಸ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಸಿ ಯಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀದ್ ಶಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 
राम राम हरे हरे आजानुलम्बित भुज कनका बदा तो संकीर्तन कपितर कमलायताक्ष विशाबरो द्विजरो जुगधर्म पालो बंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणा भतारो हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे अनर्पित चरण चिरात करुणावतीर्ण कलो समर्पयत उन्नत उज्जवल रसाम सभक्ति श्रिय हरि परट सुंदर दुदिगदम्ब सन्दीपित सदा हृदय कंदरे स्फुत सचिनंदन गौरिय गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपा परमांस जगदगुरु टोल्ड दैट इन दिस्ट्री अफ ह्यूमैन बींग इन दिस्ट्री अफ ह्यूमैन बींग दिस कैंड अफ अनप्रेजिडेंटेड कीपा वज नट पसिबल टू सी इन द होल ह्यूमैन हिस्ट्री दिस कैंड अफ अनप्रेजिडेंटेड कीपा इट वज नट पसिबल नेवर even this human being all those we could not even imagine even in dream we could not imagine this kind of kipa can come is possible this kind of kipa possible we never could realize and this kind of unprecedented kipa coming on us we are so lucky but still we are so unlucky lucky in the sense golden opportunity there in front of us bad luck because we are all misguided we cannot understand what mahaprabhu wanted to give we cannot accept we cannot understand the utility of that gift done we cannot understand the utility of that gift given by sri chandra mahaprabhu impossible many time mahaprabhu used to say that krishna prem dana is a net property we are thinking land property building money golden ornament bank account their deposit this is our property we think so we are so foolish that's why we are less interested to do hari bhajan that's why we are less interested to do hari bhajan we cannot understand the utility of that property what mahaprabhu wanted to give us But Mahaprabhu told in Chaitanya Chaitanya Mrita, we can find, Prem Dhan Bina Bhartho Dharidho Jivan Das Kori Beton Mare Deho Prem Dhan. Mahaprabhu told. Or other time, we can find in Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, we can find, No Prem Gandho Sthi Dharapi Me Haro तथा पिकंदा सौभग्य भरम प्रकाशित जदवंश विलासन लोकन विना विभर्वी विभर्मी प्राण पतंग नानु विथा वाट टू थिंग मेनी टाइम महाप्रु स्पीकिंग बट स्पेशल टू टाइम आई स्पीकिंग प्रेम धन विना व्यर्थ दरिद्र जीवन दास कोरी वेतन मोरे देह प्रेम धन महाप्रभु ब्रास्टेड इन टू टीयर्स एंड प्रेइंग टू लॉ He give me. I am very poor. I am very pure. I am a street beggar. He says, "Please give me this property." Prem don, bina vartho dorid dojiva. You make me your servant, and give me 
prem dana as a salary. As a salary, I need prem dana. This is a net property. Or sometime Mahaprabhu crying and speaking, I have no trace of prema for Bhagavan. No, nothing. No trace, no, no smell. No smell of prema I have. But still, I am trying. I am trying to unveil my luck. My luck is, you know, very bad, I know. So, Mahaprabhu speaking, No prema gandha osti dharapi me haru tathapi krandami shauvhaggabharam prakasitum jad bangshi bilasanan lokanam bhina vibharmi prana patanga gana prana patanga kanu vritha My life can be compared with an insect which has got no value. My life can be compared with one insignificant insect. If I am going to die, what will go and come? Nothing. But still, I am trying my best to unveil my luck. Shauvhaggavaram prakasitum. I like to unveil my luck. My luck is suppressed. I like to see opened. I like to express this kind of mood. I like to have that kind of mood. That Bangshi Vadan Ratha, Bangshi Bilasana Rukanam Bina. That Bangshi Dhari Krishna, who is playing on fluids. Without Krishna, how I am without Krishna, how I am going to maintain my life? Without Krishna, who is playing on fluids. Without Krishna, how I am going to maintain my life? That I am very stout. By this time, eh? by this time, I am now expressing this kind of thing. All my age gone. This is the condition. Only for this mission, try to understand. Only for this mission, I am in Chaitanya mission. Chaitanya mission, no? For this mission, Sivan Mahaprabhu, took sannyas for this mission. What is the mission? In general, in general we can say distribution of Harinam, but very secret reasons are there. That is not our topic of discussion at present. First of all, I say, Anurpita Charing Chirat Karunavaturanakalu, which was never given in the human history. Anurpita Charing Chirat Karunavaturanakalu. So he appeared. But today our discussion is not this. Just I, I want to remind you. Follow. Radha Krishna Pranaya Vikriti Ladini Shakti Rasmadi Ekatmanu Opi Deo Vedam Gatau Tau. This is Athoba or Sri Radhaya Pranaya Mahima Kiddisho Banai Vajas Ashwadda Jainad Bhutara Madhurima. This true sloka are the reason for why. But today we are going to discuss why Mahaprabhu took sannyas. These topics I can discuss sometime after. Today is not these topics. For this Chaitanya mission, to carry out this mission, carry out the mission to show how to carry out. Sivan Mahaprabhu took sannyas. There is a reason. Otherwise, Sivan Mahaprabhu need not take sannyas. Why Mahaprabhu can? He is Supreme Lord. He is Supreme Lord. Why he can take sannyas? And Mahaprabhu himself told, after taking sannyas in Katwa, I already discussed one day before, Mahaprabhu speaking, what is the utility of my sannyas? Because prem dana is my own property. Prem dana is my own property. And other bonded souls or those who are, 
eternal Siddha Mahatma, they also taking sannyas. Taking sannyas, na? Ramana Chajo, Madha Chajo, who not? Everybody they are taking the Madha Bindu. They are eternal person. And uh, bonded soul also, in course of his burden, in course, in course of their bhajan can get free. And finally, if they like to get Krishna Prema, they can also take sannyas. Of course, uh, it's not a must. Without taking sannyas also, you can get prema. That's not a... But taking sannyas means with the purpose to preach. Otherwise, no need. Bhakti Minut Thakur was without sannyas, without Baba base, without Brahmachari base, nothing. Something was there. He was a service holder, government. But still, Prema was there because eternal person. Sivas Pandit need not take sannyas because they are already sannyas. Sivas Pandit, Sivas Pandit need not take any sannyas because they are already sannyas. Heart, they are sannyas is there. Bhakti Mutta was sannyas. After that, you see, Sivananda Sen, they are all sannyas. Already, but they are in gears to light. But stay already so because sannyas mean in Gita Bhagavan already told if somebody who say no desire nothing no enmity nothing then geoho so nitya sannyasi jona deshti no kankati in Gita Bhagavan Sima Bhagavan Sri Krishna in Gita confirmed to Arjun Arjun be sure, those who have no desire, geho sa nitya sannyasi. What do you mean by nitya sannyasi? We never heard this term, nitya sannyasi. But sannyasi we heard, but nitya sannyasi, what do you mean? Nitya sannyasi means, is eternally sannyas brato is there inside heart. They need not exhibit red clothes, white clothes. And they are already sannyas. So Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking, Geho sa nitya sanya, Geho sa nitya sanyasi, Jona deshti no kankati. Who has no enmity with anything, all equal vision and kankati, no desire at all, no smell of desire. They are eternally sanyas. Mahaprabhu took sanyas, Mahaprabhu took sanyas. But I already told, when Mahaprabhu took sannyas, then we should understand the sannyas of Siman Mahaprabhu is already there in his sarup. In the sarup of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, in the sarup itself, in the sarup of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, sannyas is there. Where you find? Where you find? Everywhere. I can give you so many examples. In the Sarup of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, I mean this avatar, Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Gauranga, in his Sarup Sanyas is there already. First point is that I told Oishadyasya Samagyasya Vijyasya Jasasya Sriya Gyanu Vairagya Sriva Saro Iti Bhaga Iti Ingana Saro Bhaga Iti Ingana that's when it is already written in Shastra, Bhairagya is quite natural with Mahaprabhu. Bhairagya is natural, very quite natural with Krishna. Bhairagya is quite natural with Bhagavan Sri Krishna. Bhairagya is quite natural with Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Though externally, Though externally in the life of Bhagavan Sri Krishna, in the Leela of Bhagavan Sri Krishna, externally you cannot find any sannyas or detachment, but you are foolish, that's why you cannot see. Many times, Mahaprabhu, Bhagavan Sri Krishna wanted to prove in front of Gopikas, in front of Radha, many times wanted to prove that I have. 
extreme detachment. Many times. One example I can give. One day, Durvasa Muni coming that side of river, Jamuna. And uh, Gopikas, they like to go and serve Durvasa Muni. Because Krishna Bhagavan is the nature of Bhagavan. It is the nature of Bhagavan. Bhagavan speaking, you are Guru. Durvasa Muni is Guru. Though we know Krishna is the topmost Guru. Nitanando. Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Krishnam Bande Jagat Guru, we know. So when Gopikas they wanted to go to that side of river to worship Durvasa Muni, then say how to go? There is big water there, rainy season, we cannot go. How this kind of how we can go? Then they are asking some permission from Krishna, I mean some advice. Krishna speaking, well, you can do one thing. You can go at the side of Jamuna and pray to Jamuna. If Krishna is the topmost Brahmachari, then please give us way out. So that we can go that side of river and serve our Guru coming. You can speak. Follow? Then they are laughing. You are Vairagya, yes. Krishna singing, you try. Then going in front of Jamuna and speaking. Because usually people, they have no idea, na? Very dirty idea. They have idea related to our body, dirty body and mind. That's why they think this way. They cannot understand what is Rasalila. Nothing can be more excellent and beautiful than Rasalila, which is the topmost in love. Even Sukhdev Goswami, who is the topmost renowned city, even no cloth is there, he likes to enjoy. While, while Sukhdev Goswami discussing Rasalila, I can show you, you are blind. There Sukhdev Goswami using such word, it seems that Sukhdev Goswami already there in the Rasasthali. Such word. Using, suppose you are here with me. If I say you are going there to Namahatta, they are opened by Nityananda Balaram, I mean Sananda Sukhuta Kunya at present. If I speak this way, then what I can say? You, you all Gopikas are going there. But Sukhdev is not speaking this. So the Goswami should use this word. Oh, Gopika is going there, near Krishna. But not use this word. He is speaking, Gopikas are, Gopikas are coming. Ajogamu. Gopikas are coming. And you could, easily, you could easily say that they are going. It's more practical. You are there, you are there near Krishna? Yes, I am near Krishna. That's why I am using this word. Gopika, they are Ajogmu. Ajogmu means they are coming and meeting with Krishna. That means he is already standing there, watching the Leela. So each and every word of Bhagavatam, if you would like to take the test, rasa, you will have to go deep into. You have to leave all matter. Vishay chariya kabe shuddha habe moon. First of all, ar kabe nitai chader koruna haibe. Vishaya Vashuna Mur Kabe Tuchyavi. Eta Putum Kotha. First word. Ar Kabe Kabe. Ar Kabe is one kind of explain, exclamation. Ar Kabe. Because for infinity period I am rolling down with matter. Ar Kabe Nitai Chadir. Ar Kabe Nitai Chadir Koruna Hoive. Vishaya Vashuna Mur Kabe Tuchyavi. Vishaya Chariya Kabe. Shuddha have a moon. Kabe ham herobo sivinda. When I speak something, you become very sorry. Baba speaking so high. The, this way you can take darshan of Bindu, not before that. That's why I told, don't feel pain. Each and every word is one kind of operation I'm going to make you. But you feel sorry? Why speaking this way? Yes. You are traveling here and there, Bindavan Puri, one kind of sense gratification. 
is nothing else. The more you can travel, the more you can go inside the current of Maya. Like, you know, trimuda of triangle, you know. Ah. Trimuda triangle, you know. If you go, cha inside. The more you can travel, you can, you can test me. Test my word. The more you can travel, you can go down. <laughs> that kind of power is not there, like Madhavandapuri. You can travel to rescue people. This kind of power is there with you. Naraji can travel. You can travel. Mental stability is not there at all. So, first of all, you should realize, Ar kabe nitai chader koruna hoibe. Vishaya vasana mor kabe tuchya hoibe. When I can think, matter is nothing. But I cannot think. Because we are not 100% inclined. Follow. If we cannot go up to the point of Radharani, okay, leave it. Only 500 years back, eh, one queen, Mirabai. We are not speaking about Murabai. Why? Because she is not following Radharani. But in this context, if I follow one point, it's not bad. I am not going to accept this policy. What I mean to say, for your easy understanding, I am speaking. Follow. We are not following uh, Mirabai because she is not anyway following Radharani. She is following different way. But still, in this context, if I speak, it's not bad. Because after leaving everything, so beautiful queen going through forest, early singing. No fear the tiger, lion, jackal can eat up. A hooligan there, dockoids can come and kill. Huh? No tension, only singing and going. How possible? You can go. Uh, nobody can go. Mahaprabhu has shown us that without any tension, if you are absorbingly in Krishna Bhajan, if you are absorbing, absorbingly in Krishna Bhajan, Krishna Chinta, then no tiger can see you. Like the case I told, Raghunath Das Gosai taking water from, from Radha Kun, and tiger is there. Tiger is there. Taking water from Kunda and Raghunath was sitting at the bank of when Swanathan Gusami coming and watching from this. You crazy? You will have to stay inside room. I cannot allow. He is staying under a tree. From then, he called Brajavasi, Swanathan Gusami, make one bhajan kuti. It's foolish. No. But Raghunath Dosko say cannot see any tiger. It's kind of Leela. Tiger is there and is taking uh, no, at the bank of Radha Kund, thinking some Leela. And tiger cannot see Raghunath. But he's there. How possible that Mahaprabhu, Balabhadra, or Anabha, Adabhaman going through forest where is full of ferocious animal, full of ferocious animal. Full of ferocious animal going. No. Even Jagannath Das Babaji Maharaj, I told many times, you can remember. When Jagannath Das Babaji Maharaj is being carried by, by Bihari, Bihari taking the basket on the head. But going forward, now not going, going back. Hey, why you are going back? There's tiger lying. No tiger. Foolish. Is a goat parsha. Go. No problem. Guru Dev giving order. Go, Parsha. Foolish. Go. Really so? Tiger not going to attack. What is this? Sonatan Goswami. Same way, Jarikanda coming. They are full of tiger and elephant and everything. Eh? Tiger, lion. But no problem. Sonatan Goswami is coming. Through the same way. Mapu went through Jarikanda. Na? The same way. So it is inconceivable. We cannot even imagine. It is it is beyond our imagination. We cannot imagine. So Mahaprabhu told this way. All our Guru Bhargava and also I told from Gita. Yeah, who is eternal sannyas? 
and Mahaprabhu by in the sarup of Bhagwan, like Krishna, I told you, na. Krishna speaking, if I am genuine Brahmachari, you go and ask the Jamuna. The Jamuna giving way. Gopika's town, he's Brahmachari playing with us. Gopika, who they Gopikas? Gopikas are own Sarup Shakti, na. They are not woman. Gopikas, they are Sarup Shakti, own Sarup Shakti. Ananda Chinima Rasa Pratibha Vitavi Tavir Jeva Nijurupataya Kalavi. This look, you know. In the up, own Sarup. In Bhagavatam, Rasalila is seeking, Krishna is playing, playing with his shadow. Pratibhimra. Pratibhimra, in the mirror, in the mirror, if you stand, if you stand in front of a mirror, you can see your picture. Can you? Know? Small, small boys. The four, five years, they are looking in front of mirror, going to fight. You say, eh? very joking, they are playing. In front of mirror, small boys playing. You say, who is there? They cannot understand. This way. This is the same thing. Sha pratibhimma vibhramaha. Shukta Goswami writing, just like a, in the mirror, you know, reflection, is playing with it. Really so. Not lie, actual Siddhanta. So this kind of prema is rare. So I like to run fast because you are not giving me time to discuss in details. So Gopikas, they are sure that Krishna is really Bhamachari. Then going to serve Durvasa. After serving Durvasa, so many pots, thousands of pots of sweet, cake, so many things, puri. So many. Durvasa, if they are going to pray pranam, you please accept. Durvasa opening eye, all coming. All. Thousands of pot, finish all. Anything you have, like the case of Krishna in the form of Giriraj Maharaj asking, hey, anything, anything else you have? Anything more? Ano or. Ano or mana? Bring more. That Anur village is there. I used to stay. Anur village. Krishna, after all, finished. Thousands of pot and everything. Anything else you have? Bring bring more. Anur or? Anur or mane? Bring more. So it's possible. Durvasa is also not ordinary. Sankar avatar. Sankar coming in the form. So you can show this kind of magic. After eating, asking to Durvasa. Now how, now how we can cross the river and go? How we can cross the river is full, you know, Jamuna is full of. Durvasa speaking, you can go at the bank of Jamuna and pray, if Durvasa Muni is not taking anything except grass. Grass, you know, Durva? Grass? Many sadhus I know, they are making juice of grass. Grass, grass, Durva, Durva. Grass, very small grass. They are making paste or making juice and taking. So Durba is asking, you can ask Jamuna, is, you, you can ask Jamuna, you all can ask Jamuna, if Durba Samuni is also only drinking the gist, gist, juice of grass, then you please give us way out. They are going to, if Durba is only, you know, taking juice of Durva, if it is true, then keep us away. Yeah, give him truth. Ha, huh, my lord. He's taking thousands of pots of pusadam, everything, but say, now not taking. How possible? It's a big fallacy. Yeah, like that. You cannot understand. That is your foolishness. Because you are not 100% in the line of Bhakti Vyotakura and Prabhupada. I, I am very sorry. I never like to give you pain, but I'm bound to speak. I cannot speak lie. The day you can follow Bhakti Thakur and Pova 100%, then you can feel yourself. No fallacy. But now we cannot fallacy. After hearing this kind of all Harikatha, sometimes you can express doubt. What Maharaj says is it true. I know it. But still I cannot change my word. 
So, for Supreme Lord, Aishadjasya Samagrasya Vijasya Jodha, I already told. At the same time, Bhairagya is there. Why, why Bhagavan is the Supreme Enjoyer? If you, if you ask me one question, now if you ask me one question, why Bhagavan, why Maharaj Bhagavan is Supreme Enjoyer? Why you are not enjoyer? The reason behind is that we are like dog. Guru Padma used to say, in front of a street dog, if you give deshi ghee, deshi ghee, you know, Indian cow ghee. Without Indian cow ghee, I am not using. If I some Bhagavan arrange, I am automatically arranging. From Bindavan, some Prajava say, you go, go and send Baba, this ghee is Indian. <laughs> they know I am not giving Indian cow, 100%. Then I am taking. So, but Guru Padma used to say, I am joking with you. Actually, Guru Padma used to say, my son, street dogs, they cannot digest a desi ghee. In, you, give, you can give place and be everything, you can give meat, you can get dog. Can. But if you give ghee, then dysentery. Dog cannot digest. So we are like, especially I am. I am not speaking, I have no right to speak about you. I am like a street dog. Eh? This is the condition. So who can realize the mission of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu? Who can understand? Why Mahaprabhu took sannyas? That is the reason. First. So, why Mahaprabhu? Why Mahaprabhu is the soul? Why Mahaprabhu is the supreme enjoyer? If you ask me, I say yes, Mahaprabhu is supreme enjoyer. Because, because supreme detachment is there with Bhagavan. If you ask me, why Mahaprabhu is supreme Enjoyer, sense enjoyer, Rishikesh, why? Only one reason. Because he is supreme enjoyer, because he is a su supreme detachment is there with him. Supreme detachment. Nobody in this infinity world can compare himself with Chaitanya Mahaprabhu or Krishna. Same. Regarding detachment. That's why 20 minutes before, 25 minutes before I told, the sannyas of Sivan Mahaprabhu is a sarup. In sarup, in the sarup of, in the sarup of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu already there. Though of course sarup and Chaitanya Mahaprabhu are non-different. In case, in our case, our sarup, in, but we can, when we can discover real body, real body, spiritual body, discovered, then sarup is same. Follow. Oho meva kachit brahman sanyas asramam asritaha hari bhaktim grahavayami kalau pap hatano narano. From Puran, I speak. Bhagavan Sikh is not speaking in front of Vyasadeva. Oho meva, I myself, not that my avatar or something. Try to understand. Bhagavan speaking, this, this you see myself, no? This, not my avatar. I myself. Ahameva, eva mane affirmative. Affirmative. Ahameva kachit brahman. Sanyas asrama masritaha. Hari bhaktim grahayami kalo papa hatano narano. All these people in this Kali Yuga, some. Bhagavan speaking to Vasudeva, Ahameva Kachit Brahm. This I myself, sometime in sometime, sometime in some Kali, sometime in some special Kali. Though it is not indicated directly, but it means so. Ahameva Kachit. Otherwise the word Kachit, those who have some basic idea about Sanskrit, they know. Kachit means by chance, sometime, rare. Ahameva Kachit Brahman. Sanyas asrama masritaha hari bhaktim grahayami kalu papa hatano narana. This I myself in samkali rare sometime I am taking sanyas brato. 
I myself taking sannyas. Why, why, why? Why? But only the reason is that to help them accept Hari Bhakti, the only solution, the absolute solution. Because in your life, absolute solution what? Money. Money solution. You can go and collect more money to ensure. No. Solution is Hari Bhakti. So Mahaprabhu is speaking, Ahameva Kachit Brahman Shanyas Astrama Asritaha. Sometime I accept Sanyas Brato to help people accept Hari Brato, Hari Bhakti. Because especially this Kali is full of Papa, Papa Hatano Narano. All people, nobody can say we are out of sinful. We are out of sin, nobody can say. Some are other way. I am not speaking about Guru Bhargava, I have no idea city. I am speaking about myself. Or not totally free, maybe. Or maybe free. Who can say? Bhagavan can say. I have no right to. So, nobody can claim that we are, I am, we are free of Papa. Sin must be there. Kalu Papa Hatano Narayano. Because they can never ex they can never understand Hari Bhakti. So I myself going and accepting sannyas brata and try to. This is the reason. And now I can go on speaking about different, different secret example by the help of which you can understand that the sannyas of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is there inside him, Sarup. Inside Sarup is there. I can give some example that you can understand. So, one example I can give, how pure sannyasi going to deliver all fallen soul. Like the case of Nityananda Prabhu and Gauranga. Nityananda Prabhu going to deliver Jagai Madai. That time Mahaprabhu was not sannyas. Mahaprabhu was not sannyas. Mahaprabhu later took sannyas. Actually, it's one kind of drama, a practical drama. So, it's very interesting how Jagai Madhav was delivered. One example I can speak about Sila Bhakti Hida Banudev Goswami. With full attention you can hear. Maharaj went to 24 Parganas. 24 Parganas, pa, Harikatha. For 5-7 days on some topics. He was a big orator, very nice speaker. Follow. Maharaj was a great devotee. Maharaj speaking Harikatha. And uh, every day speaking Harikatha in the evening time. Follow. But Maharaj has information that in the village there is one great you know, danger in the village. What is the danger? One notorious Gunda. Notorious, very famous. He is killing people, woman, case of man, so many. Whole village fear him. Whenever he hear his name. All sinful activities, even policemen fear him. This kind of thing. Extreme point, like Jagai Madai. One day, that Gunda, I don't know why, he saw Maharaj previous night. Previous night, anyway, people are going to hear, attend Harikatha. He also went from distance, watching Maharaj. Hearing something, not with a mood to, not with a mood to hear Harikatha, but still gone. Next day, morning time, around 9 o'clock, he is coming at the gate of Sila Banagasya, where he is, that time he took shelter in a building, a room. He coming, room was open, he pray some Dandavad and praying to Sila Bangasi Maharaj that I am full, I am extremely, I am extremely, you know, I am in extremely dangerous situation because I have 
I have done so many sinful activities, endless. Can you save me? He suddenly asking to Ban Goswami, can you save me? Is possible for you? Or you can also hate me? Ban Goswami is speaking, you can come to me in the evening time. Huh? In the evening time, you can come. And the evening time is coming, all pandal is full of people, no space. And that gunda, that hooligan, that notorious, you know, he is just backside with some mood, has some doubt. Maharaj can, why Maharaj speaking? So backside he is standing. He has no power to sit in the Harikata. Bango Singh Maharaj from long distance calling, Hey, you come. Everybody watching. Maharaj calling this notorious gunda. You come. Come here. You sit here near me. People surprise. Why Maharaj going to call this gunda? What is the business with him? After that, Maharaj went on speaking Harikatha for two hours, continuously. After Harikatha is over, finishing line, Maharaj speaking, I know you all express some doubt about me. Why I am going to call this notorious gunda in front of me? I know you are having some doubt inside you. So I am going to give some answer to you. What is the answer? Maharaj speaking, I know. He is a number one gunda. He already had his stamp. His stamp. I know. But this morning, I mean today morning, he came to me and paid pranam to me, Randavad, and he uh, asking me, can you deliver me, Maharaj? Because you are sannyas, great devotee, can you deliver me? That is the only point. He can have he can have countless drawback. He can have countless sinful activities in his life. But only positive thing is coming in front of me and asking me, Can you deliver me, Maharaj? Follow. That's why Maharaj is speaking. That is the only quality by what? Uh, that is the only quality for why I give first preference to him. But none of you, no Acharya, nothing. Now speaking this way. At least that man is out of duplicity. That's why he can expect some solution. But other man, no solution. They can play some drama. So, Mahaprabhu speaking, I mean Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking in front of Vyasadeva, some, some time I am coming, taking, ex and, uh, coming in this world and uh, appear in this world and accept sannyas brata to deliver all fallen soul because Kali is, is the age of controversy and Kali Kal, all everybody is Kali Kal, everybody. They are full of sinful activities. Nobody can claim that I am out of. That's why I am coming. So this is the indication for why Mahaprabhu, this is the indication Mahaprabhu, I mean Krishna Bhagavan directly speaking. So we understand the reason for why Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, I mean Bhagavan Sri Krishna, coming in the form of Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Now I will have to prove that Mahaprabhu itself from the beginning, I mean when he took birth, from then, from then onward he started preaching Harina, when he was just crawling or in the bed. Why? Because in Chaitanya Bhagavad Gita, it was a symptom. It was a symptom of that baby that if somebody is speaking Hare Krishna, then the baby stopped crying. So all local people, all Mayapur, all they could they by by then they could realize the only solution when the boy is crying, ah, Hare Krishna, then the boy is sleeping. And if you again stop Hare Krishna, they again, again can try. There is only solution. So all Matajis, they come, Hare Krishna, Gaur Hari, Nemai, this way playing. So this way, you see the technique. So Mahaprabhu is there. 
in the bed, small baby. But still from then, he is a, a, you know, following one technique by the help of which you are bound to speak Harina. That is the technique from the beginning. Follow. There is a technique. This is a technique. How Mahaprabhu can everybody bound to speak Harinam? Second point, sannyas is there itself in Saru. How you can know? First of all, I can say when Bisharup, you heard, Bisharup took sannyas. Bisharup took sannyas, na? elder brother. Gone. Father, mother crying like a crazy, mad. Then Mahaprabhu, the small boy, coming in front of father and mother. Why you are crying? Why you are crying? My elder brother gone, take, taken sannyas, it's good. Mahaprabhu speaking, a small boy, what you, what, how you know? But Mahaprabhu, the small boy, is speaking, why you are crying? It is very good. My elder brother taken sannyas and gone, because he can help to deliver all the father's side and mother's side. Father's side and mother's side, all destiny they can deliver. So my elder brother, Vishwarup has taken sannyas. Why you are crying? I am there, the only son. I can serve you. I can serve you. Why you are crying? So this way, Mahaprabhu giving consolation to father and mother. A at the same time, be careful, the small boy of four or five, how he has idea that Bishwaru, my elder brother, has taken sannyas is good. And he is going to, uh, going to deliver all father, son, mother. That's when Mahapu is going to approve the sannyas of elder brother. Nobody knows. IQ, if you have like in competitive examination, some IQ exam there. If you have your IQ, foolish people, you know, what? You can they can avoid that question. But those who IQ, they can understand. Hey? What is the indication? How that small boy can understand what is sannyas or not? So it must be some indication. He's going to approve sannyas. First point. So father, mother, keeping hope. Mahaprabhu speaking. I can serve father and mother. So Lakshmi Narayan can become very happy with me. <laughs> Mahaprabhu speaking. He himself is the original cause of Narayan. Lakshmi Narayan become very happy with me. I can serve father and mother. No problem. Don't, don't worry. Don't cry. So clever, you see. After some day, <coughs> after some day, after some day, it is written in Chaitanya Bhagavat, Mahaprabhu took one prasadi betel leaf. Pan, 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 betel leaf. Prasadi. It is only prasadi. We have no right to take. We can offer Krishna. Follow. Prasadi is tell you. He taken, small boy, after they fall down on ground, no consciousness, nothing there. Oh my God. No consciousness, the boy gone. After that, after that, after great effort of Sankirtan, this, that, after that, consciousness came back. And Mahapu get up and speaking. My elder brother, Bisharup, came and requesting me, why not you take sannyas? Why not you take sannyas? You take sannyas, it's good. Then I am praying to my elder brother, I am a small boy, I have no idea about what is sannyas, what is what. Is what. So, well, I can serve I can serve father and mother. It is more practical for me. And uh, Lakshmi Narayan become happy. My brother, elder brother calling me. Come. Come, my brother. You come. You take sannyas. I said, no. I don't understand anything about what is sannyas. I don't understand. I was foolish. By this indication, Mahaprabhu always wanted to indicate. Mapo wanted to give some indication that there is possibility of sannyas in his life. Nobody understand. Nobody understand. One day, one day in dream, Mapo watching 
that some exalted personality giving sannyas mantra to him in dream and after the after uh, after getting up from bed he is going to explain in front of his own parikar parikar mane parsha all devotees today 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 in dream today in dream one exalted personality came he gave me one sanyas mantra what to do sanyas mantra then devotees they are afraid oh maybe prabhu going to give some indication maybe prabhu prabhu going to give some indication who knows otherwise why this kind of thing happening repeatedly they are fearing maybe prabhu can leave us some day <clears throat> they are not speaking openly but they they fear inside heart they fear inside heart again example like so many example i can give to prove that the swarup by swarup swarup in the swarup of sri chaitanya mahaprabhu krishna krishna chaitanya mahaprabhu sanyas brato was itself there inside in a hidden form you cannot see one day mahaprabhu doing sankirtan jagya you know na mahaprabhu used to do sankirtan jagya in shiva sangam <coughs> don't know mahaprabhu used to do sankirtan jagya in shiva sangam are he don't know whole night whole night mahaprabhu used to do sankirtan jagya whole night sankirtan jagya one day mahaprabhu speaking today i am not getting enjoyment i am not getting the taste why no why everything okay no you check up something must be wrong no prabhu you sing is doing sankirtan in the meantime all the housewives wives mean or brother wife his wife so many wives are all women mataji just started crying Very heavily, immediately Shiva Pandit from Sankirtan Jagya. He is also dancing, you know, Sankirtan Ras. Immediately going inside room. Oh, what happens? Why can't the boy gone? The only son. Don't cry, don't cry. If you cry, I can go and jump into Ganga to finish my life. Boy gone. i want to get that kind of luck i want to get that kind of luck that when supreme lord dancing in my room and i can live my body whereas that jivat my soul lucky ananta brahmanda nayak the parat parakreshya supreme lord is standing in my mandir at the same time the boy going to live body is a question of enjoyment is not the question of you know crying if you cry and if some disturbance going to happen in the sankirtan ras then be sure i can go and jump into ganga to i can jump it be careful if you like to cry when sankirtan is over sankirtan rasa then you can cry not now then stop make them make them set up and going inside and dancing in the meantime some devotees came to know what happened those sivas those sivas pandit wanted to hide those sivas pandit wanted to hide the chapter but still some devotee came to know what happened then after that mahaprabhu dancing and dancing after that speaking today i am not going to get that kind of test usually what i am getting what happened shiva is not going to speak somebody would say prabhu the only son of shiva has gone from the material world what do you mean yes the only son of shiva's pandit gone from the where 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 mahapu started crying wanted to see the jivatma i mean the body and mahapu started into tears and speaking 
Oh my God! This kind of devotion, they sell everything in front of me, their body, mind, property, everything, son, daughter, wife, they are all sold, all sold for me. Then by chance, it was slip of tongues, you can say, but I cannot say like that. Mahaprabhu speaking, this kind of devotee, how I can leave them? How I can leave them? Are, where from the question of leaving them coming? The devotees are thinking, why Mahaprabhu is speaking this way? This kind of devotee, those who are their son gone, wife gone, they are not crying. They are, they are, they always like to serve me. How I can leave them? Mahaprabhu give indication. Follow, indication. Where from the question of living? Where from the question of living us coming? Oh, must be Mahaprabhu, must, must be, must be Prabhu can take, it must be so. Then Mahaprabhu is planning to take sannyas. Oh my God, what will happen? All blackout all around without Prabhu. Follow? Another example I can give. When Mahaprabhu, in course of his teaching Vyakaran, when Mahaprabhu, in course of his teaching Vyakaran, went to Bangladesh, you know, Mahaprabhu, at present Bangladesh, that time not Bangladesh. That time not Bangladesh, only East Bengal, West Bengal. It was India. Mahaprabhu went there to teach Vyakaran, but the teach Vyakaran is not, purpose is different. Parpa is not said because Nityananda Bhu already wanted to put some special kripa there. That's why Mahaprabhu wanted to go and distribute. So, actually, it is up and down. Nityananda Bhu went there after. And that also reason. After, and, you know, Gauranga Mahaprabhu went first in course of teaching Vyakaran. But Chaitanya Mahaprabhu came later. Follow. So, anyway, when went there, then in course of teaching Vyakaran, Mahaprabhu helping them how to come out of bondage, material bondage, Mahaprabhu helping them. By chance, one day, one man named Tapan Misra, in, in his dream, in his dream, one exalted figure came. That is Saman Mahaprabhu, golden complexion. Hello, oh, no. sorry, Mahaprabhu didn't come, one exalted personality came and giving advice. Because Sanatana Goswami Pad cannot calculate that what is the exact sadhan bhakti, sadhu sadhan tattva. Up to now, Sanatana Goswami is very nice, uh, Sanatana actually, uh, Tapan Mishra. He was a very nice man, he was a great devotee. The, he cannot understand, he cannot calculate what is the exact procedure of sadhu sadhan tattva. He don't know. By chance in dream, by chance in his dream, one exalted, you know, personality came and giving advice, you know, advice to Tapan Misra. Tapan Misra, you go there, particular place, he is speaking. There one, you can find Supreme Lord, there you can find one big Vyakaran master, Nimai Pandit. But know it for sure, he is Supreme Lord. Really? Yes. You go. He can, he can teach you properly what is Sadhu Sadhana Tattva. Follow. Don't worry. Get up and go there, particular place, where you can find one Vyakaran teacher, professor of Vyakaran. Nimai Pandit, be sure. He is actually Supreme Lord. He go and ask him. What is Sadhu Sadhana Tattva? Then he is going in the morning time and going to pay prostrate Dhanda. Looking at oh, really? He is not ordinary man. By watching a Mahapurush, Ajanulambita Bhujavuka Nakha Padatho, he eh? can understand. Ah, why you come? I like to know about Sadhu Sadhana Tattva. I cannot understand. I have so much complicacy. I am in confusion. Well, you see it. Then Mahaprabhu is going to teach, teach him, this is Sadhu Sadhan Tattva. Mahaprabhu, Nam Sankirtan Kalau Param Upai. Follow. So, this is the procedure. 
then he was so much impressed and attracted by Mahaprabhu's personality. I like to stay with you. I, I like to go to Navadhi with you. No. No. You cannot go with me. You do bhajan now. After some day, you can go to Varanasi. Varanasi? Why? I like to stay with you. No. You go to Varanasi. There, I can meet with you. Hari. When Mahaprabhu can take sannyas, when in course of a North India tour, because first, first South Indian troop, na? first of all, after taking sannyas, Mahaprabhu went to South India. First of all, what they do, after that Puri, I'm from there to South India. And when North India, later he took. But Mahaprabhu's planning is there, you see? How Mahaprabhu can speak this way? That you go and wait there in Varanasi, someday I can meet with you. What do you mean? That time no question of sannyas. Mahaprabhu didn't take sannyas that time. But Mahaprabhu forecast. You go to Varanasi, uh, there you can meet with I can meet with you. Really so? That is also one kind of mystery, one mysterious indication that Mahaprabhu can go out of home. Also, Saru. Another example I can give, so many examples I can give. When Sankirtan Rasa going on every day, in Siva Sangan, every day, night time, Mahapur not sleeping, with all devotees. That time, so many people used to come, they like to see Sankirtan Rasa, they used to knock the, hey, open the door, open the door, tap, 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 tap. I like to see Sankirtan. It is the order of Siman Mahaprabhu, don't open the door. Don't open the door. So nobody can open. So only they are, dam, 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 open the door. We like to see Sankit. Nobody open. One day, one powerful Brahman came. And he liked to call, hey, open, I like to see Sankitan. Nobody opening. That Brahman became very unhappy. I like to get entry inside. What kind of Sankirtan they are doing? I like to see. Check up. They don't open. Then, he gone away. He was very sorry. He was very, you know, angry. Why? They are not opening the door. Okay. After that, after some day, after some day, Ma, that, that Brahman gone to Ganga to take bath. Ma, that boy, that government, oh, every day, every day, everybody going. Uh, but particularly that day also, he gone. Every day going. And by chance, he could see Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. I mean, Gauranga, Nimai. That you, you, ah, for you, I am getting pain. I am Brahman. I am getting pain. You give me pain. You don't, eh? you didn't open the gate. I wanted to get entry into Rasas. Shankitan. But you didn't open gate. So you have to get punishment for that. I am pure Brahman. I curse you with this one. I curse you. He's going to tone. Tone. I curse you. You cannot get any family life enjoyment cannot be there in your life. You curse that Brahman. Going to cut this, you know, scarted, torn. I curse you. In your whole life, you cannot get any family life enjoyment. Mahaprabhu laughing. Clap. Oh, very good. This kind of benediction I want. Huh? What? This kind of blessing I want. You are giving me cards, but it's one kind of blessing. What do you mean? What do you mean? There are also indications. That Mahaprabhu shortly going to take sannyas. Yes or not? This way, all the way, Mahaprabhu taking preparation, pre plan. That's when in the sarup of Bhagavan, sannyas is already there. Only in the sarup of Krishna you could not you could not see openly. Only the difference that openly we could not you could not realize. But sannyas was there with Krishna also. Topmost sannyas. You could not see. But in the case of Gauranga, 
I mean, Sri Krishna Chaitanya, you can understand that, well, Bhagavan is going to take sun is going away. That the same thing, Bhagavan Sri Krishna told to Vaisa Deva, I have done, I have done, I have done so many things for this bonded soul, but they could not understand. My mood, my activities, my rasa lila, they could not understand. They blame me. They blame me. Oh my God. To deliver them, I came. Rupa Goswami was writing, without Krishna, because that time, Gauranga Mahapu didn't come, na? Rupa Goswami was writing, without Krishna, who was successful to distribute prema even among, among, you know, these creepers, deer, you know, birds, Krishna was there. Goswami Bhaiji. Except Krishna, except Krishna, who was successful to give prema to birds and bees, you know, all herbs or at the same time, you know, creeper is true. But still there was restriction. Whereas Bhagavan told, Mai bhakti hi bhutanam amrito taya kalpate. Devotion towards me and to my lotus feet is the only nectarian object, nectar. Amrita. But people cannot understand. People cannot understand. So, Krishna speaking, the reason for why I come here, nobody can understand. They all blame me. Oh, when Bhagavan is speaking in Gita, Madh Jaji Ma Namaskuru, you worship me, eh? you bow down to me. Are this kind of you know, clever man is many there we have seen in our life. Who is speaking, come to me. Pay pranam to me, surrender to me. But Krishna is speaking all right, but people misunderstand. When Gita and Gita Bhagavan is speaking, that Madhijaji Mangam's Guru, Madhijaji, you worship me and you pay pranam to me. Then those are very clever. Eh? You are enjoying your life and going to eh, come to me and bow down. But most of the people misunderstood Krishna. Very clever, huh? Enjoying your life, and after that, don't give it to me. Bhagavan Sri Krishna was very sorry. Bhagavan Sri Krishna was speaking, well, I wanted to deliver them. But they cannot understand. That's why in Chaitanya Chaitanya it is written, Anto dhyan kori Krishna kori lo anuman. After disappearing, Krishna thinking, what will, what will be the result? They cannot understand. So well, I can come in the form of form of Gauranga. That document is there, Imlitala. Also, one reason, so many things I like to speak, but I cannot cover because time is not there. Ignore, give, give me time. In Vishnu Priya Grantho, Bengali, I already wrote do. So many things, Tattva Siddhanta. The prior reason. I mean the starting point. I can speak one or two examples. When Mahaprabhu was after coming back from Gaya, Mahaprabhu started started exhibiting abnormal condition. It is not abnormal, but it seems like abnormal, abnormal, but not abnormal. After coming back from, after offering funeral cake, after offering funeral cake to father in Gaya. Is coming is uh, expressing some crazy attitude. All applying, you know, uh, oil, caustic, costly oil, or water, or water, but still condition is very bad. This way, Mahaprabhu trying his best to check himself, but cannot do. While while teaching Bakaran to them, Mahaprabhu only speaking about kitna. Oh, this formula Bakaran, it means kitna. This formula, Datu, Pratyay, is Bengali term, Sanskrit. 
those who are backer. So all Krishna. So all students speaking, previously we never heard this kind of explanation from you. Previously, we never heard this kind of explanation from you. But now we explain in a strange way. Uh, yes or not? Is wrong or right? Right, exactly right. But we cannot understand the normal way of teaching of Bakaran from you. As you used to do before. After that, one day, some student of one troll, they are speaking, begging, sticking to Mahaprabhu. Hey, why you are speaking Gopi, 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 Gopi? Don't, don't speak Gopi, Gopi. Speak Krishna. Then you can get the... Then Mahaprabhu, after seeing, hearing the name of Krishna, full of prema, na? abnormal prema. Taking one stick and running away, I can beat you. Don't speak the name of Krishna. Krishna is going to cheat, cheat my Radharani and Gopikas. But they don't understand. They fly and take a meeting. They are making one meeting. Okay, today Nimai wanted to beat us. Well, we are ready to beat him also. Who is he? Who is his father? He think himself big personality. He likes to beat us. We can also beat. He all arrange one stick everything. If from today onward, if something happen, then we can also beat him. After getting the information, Mahapu started crying. I wanted to deliver them. I wanted to deliver them without any condition. I wanted to deliver them all foolish people, all material people. Whereas Mahaprabhu told to Adhyayya Gosai I have no time to discuss. You go and distribute prema to everybody. So prema. Go on. And Mahaprabhu also took sanya. Because Mahaprabhu crying, I wanted to deliver them. But they could not understand my mood. They want to beat me. With this, with this mood that they want to beat me, all their study, all their shukriti, everything finished. Because they want to, they are making a plan to beat me. So better I can take sannyas and go door to door. By watching me, I am a sannyas, beggar. So surely they can pay pranam, pranam sannyas. So I can take sannyas. For this mission, Mission, very secret mission is also there, but, uh, but the clear mission is that, like to distribute Nam Prem. That is the basic. After the secreting is there, secreting is not for other people, those who are pure Vishnu. So Mahaprabhu took decision, that's a very painful, very, very painful. I have no time to discuss. So Mahaprabhu, to carry out his own mission of preaching Nam Prema. Started distribution. That is the original cause. That is the exact reason, secret reason for why. Those who are heartless, those who are making some conspiracy, everything. Mahaprabhu, after taking sannyas, going to breast keep up to them. That is the reason. So, the meaning, I mean the reason for why, to carry out his mission, he was bound to take sannyas. In Vishnu Priya book, I already wrote there, I have written there, that Mahaprabhu speaking to Vishnu Priya, many times, Mahaprabhu giving consolation to Vishnu Priya. Vishnu Priya could realize, because news, News, news spreading like wind. News spreading like wind. Vishnu Priya crying and crying. 18 years there, 16 or 18, 16 years. Small girl. But eternal Shakti. Vishnu Priya, Lokhi Priya, both. Now crying and speaking. My heart, Prabhu, my heart, Prabhu, I am hearing from public that you are going to take sannyas? How you can leave me? How you can leave your mother? This way started crying. Many times, many times, 
with joking mood, Mahapu wanted to make the sentiment, you know, light. But the Vishnu Priya knows. He wanted to make the sentiment light, but Vishnu Priya is very clever. Someday, Mahaprabhu is going to catch the hand of Vishnu Priya. You will have to help me. You will have to help me. Because without your help, I cannot deliver all bonded souls. So you will, have, you will have to take the main role. What do you mean? You will have to permit me so that I can take sannyas. Eh? Yes. If you permit me, if I take sannyas, then and then all people can cry that Gauranga Nitananda, Gauranga, I mean Nimai, going away, leaving his Shakti, everything. Mother, father, they can cry. Because people are so heartless, you have to cooperate with me. You are eternally with me. Don't forget, don't cry. If you at all like to cry, you cry for Vishnu. Because your name is Vishnu Priya. Mahapu not speaking, I am Supreme Lord. Your name is Vishnu. Vishnu Priya. Your name is Vishnu Priya. Try to justify the meaning of your name. At all, if you like to cry, you cry for Vishnu. Is the eternal, all pervading peasant. So you permit me. This way, Mahaprabhu wanted to pray to Vishnu prayer repeatedly, craving prayer. I beg to you, if you don't permit me to take sanya, then I cannot deliver the whole. They are heartless, all people in matter, they are in hell. I have to deliver them one by one. Yes. This way, for the sake of this mission, Chaitanya mission, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu himself took sannyas. That is the reason. So many things I like to speak, but time cannot permit. I am not responsible because you are not giving time. You are not giving me time. You are responsible for that. So anyway, excuse me what to do. So, Anurpita Charing Chirata Karunayavaturna Kalu Samarpayatu Unnata Ujjala Rasam Sabhakti Sriyam Harihi Purata Sundara Dhuti Kadamba Sandibito Sada Hidai Kandores Purutuba Sisachinandana Vancha Kalpatru Sikipasindu Paditanang Pavane Bhavishnapya. I can, uh, on those coming days, I can explain something how Mahaprabhu adopted the technique how to preach, you know. 